I'm in Calgary, Canada, in a working class suburb, and I'm gonna show you a permaculture system. What this garden could be is right here. We get down to minus 40 on a regular basis, so the first thing that we actually undertook on this property was to retrofit the entire house. Just to tell you that the, the, the rocket stove sucks the air through up into here and back down again. So this is a heat exchanger. It's, up, it's pretty hot right there, it's like a stove. That's fast heat into the air. Where this is a slow storage of heat and a slow release of heat in the stove. It's, a, it's an engineer, so there's a lot of clever engineering features in this whole thing. Here at the front of the house, the dark stone dry stacked walls here and here gain heat and allow us to grow tomatoes that don't normally ripen in this climate. So here they are nice and red, gaining that advantage of thermal mass. Great strategy. Three years ago we uh, sent our, this soil away to the Soil Food Web Lab and uh, they called us back and I've never heard a scientist more excited. Um, they said that we had the best garden soil that they'd ever analyzed. <laughs> So that really means anybody could do this, anybody, all you need is small space intensity with good design and you can go from that to that and get the best soil that you could possibly, that's, that's a testament, that's, that's a total testament from there to there. <laughs>